here's an interesting game, and sorry about that humming sound in the background. That's my disc resurfacer. Scratches, a suspense adventure. I just sold this. The buyer actually bought two games, this and uh, Mech Commander for Windows 98. So this game, Scratches, is a adventure game, a scary kind of horror game from 2006 from Nucleosis and Got Game. And I just want to show you how it looks, uh, the packaging, because I feel like a lot of these games don't really get the appreciation they deserve. We'll start off with the back. Pretty, pretty simple. Something sinister waits in the old Blackwood house. The northern wasteland, so I guess that's probably England, right? But I want to show you the, the manual on the front cover. So there's the front cover art. A cool red scratching motif. Horror graphic adventure game from the first person viewpoint. You will experience the game as if you were actually there. Fully clicked or fully controlled via the mouse with a point and click system. Features. A realistic <laughs> Victorian mansion. Impressive, impressive special effects. I wish it was in color, the manual was but that's probably a bit more expensive. Here's the story. You'll step into the role of Michael Arthate, a blooming writer flush with cash from the sales of his debut novel as he moves into an imposing Victorian mansion that he just bought set in the outskirts of a small rural town in northern England. Someone who lived there committed suicide, looks like. Soon, Michael comes to realize his arrival may have disturbed some sinister forces that have been resting and waiting inside the place for many years. They got all the characters. And I guess just, you know, pause the video if you want to read any of these. I won't take up too much of your time. They have a, a part for the house. I mean, this is, I don't know, I feel like a lot of games now, the, at least the games that I see, don't really have this much in-depth exposition in the manuals and I wish they did all the stages you'll be on <coughs> excuse me the crypt the garden and then here's just the basic setup so it's not like a, a horribly <laughs> in-depth manual but just enough to kind of give you a sense of the environment and the theme. And if you want to buy this game, I think the buyer that I sold it to paid like 11 or 12 bucks for it. So it's pretty cheap to have a piece of, uh, of history. The game is in color, unlike the manual. Evil never dies. It rests. Whoa. Too spooky for me. If you guys like this, give it a thumbs up and subscribe and I'll see you later.